I was Lena Horne. Um, of course. <laughs> People sleep on that movie. It's a really okay. great. It's a really great. Honey, I just well. watched it the other day and was just like, <laughs> <laughs> oh, exactly. So. What is good, wishers? Welcome back. I'm your host, Morgan Ashley, and we are here on Indie Tuesdays. If you are new, welcome. Let me give you a quick run through of what we do here. Every week, I come across great, talented indie artists, and I get to share with you about them and their up and coming music and their projects. Today, I have with me Secret Spot LA's latest winner, Anna Maria. Welcome to my show. Thank you so much Hello. for being here. I love it. <laughs> We've got great energy already. I don't know if you can tell, but it's, we do. It's, it's awesome. Is. Thank you so much for being here. <laughs> of course. Especially during the holidays. Happy December. Oh my God. Yes. <laughs> birthday month. Oh, I like it. <laughs> so you get birthday presents and Christmas presents. Sometimes. Something but mostly depends. it's like you see everybody for Christmas and like, happy birthday and Merry oh, Christmas. <laughs> You can't be giving her two for one. She's got to get birthday yeah. presents and Christmas presents. But I guess not I wouldn't agree with that. Like that but, yeah. you know. But, <laughs> I digress. <laughs> so we know about your birthday. We know that you've been the latest winner of Secret Spot LA. Mm -hmm. And uh, you have such a great and powerful voice. But those who are just knowing about you the first time, I know you have a great, you've, you've been doing your study. You have, you have a great background in, mm -hmm. in your works on your musical journey. Yes. So uh, <laughs> tell me a little bit of more about like your your KSU appearances to uh, to your River Days, Days appearances. <laughs> I mean, there's so many people that you've worked with, and that's already um, a great build. But I just want to know uh, what the process kind of was like up until this point. Well, it's been a long. <laughs> No, really, though. Um, I was raised in Inkster, Michigan, which is near Detroit. Okay. Um, and I went to Inkster High. Okay. And I was in the music academy there. And so we were allowed to go to a studio okay. once a week for like an hour and get to learn oh, how to be in the industry. And... You know how you, you grow up in church, which right. is what I did, and was in choir my entire life. And so I knew singing is what I wanted to pursue. Okay. And so after I graduated yes. high school, I went to Kentucky State University um, on a scholarship, too. Go ahead. <laughs> Get in. Yes. <laughs> Um, I did love it there, and then I toured with their concert choir, mm -hmm. which was um, pretty much all around the East Coast. Okay. Yeah. Um, really fun experience. Uh, <laughs> and after that, I ended up coming back home and going to Henry Ford, and I studied theater there. Nice. Yep. And then... Um, so would you, would you say that you are also like a Broadway performer as well? Or have you tried that and you're like, ah, I have my thing. I have. Okay. Oh, for sure. Definitely in high school, we did productions and I was like, let's say the whiz. I played Glinda. Okay. <laughs> I was Lena Horn. <laughs> um, of course. <laughs> people, sleep, people sleep on that movie. It's a really okay. great, it's a really great song. I mean, I just watched well. it the other day yeah. and was just like... <laughs> Oh, exactly. <laughs> so, um, and then I ended up being two characters in our next one, which was Dream Girls. Oh, I, those are the singers. I played uh, Tony in the True Tones. Oh, so I yes. was like playing a guy, and I was like, <laughs> <laughs> she's and, a well-rounded singer. You know, okay, she's I'm versatile. very talented actress, <laughs> singer, actress, songwriter, model, performer. You know, model. Okay. I have modeled. Um, Kiki Sheard has a line out called uh, 1160, okay. which I have been her runway model, nice. and um, I also modeled for her um, like Instagram and website. Okay. All those. Yeah. So we can definitely catch a little bit of you here and there and yeah, everywhere on social know. media. Okay. okay. <laughs> So you yeah. worked, you, you've done your work, you've done your studies, especially with quartet testing. I know they've been inquiring, <laughs> it's all about quartet testing. Oh. 
Those were one of my horrible days because back in the day, I was in, a, I went to an arts high school and there yeah. was, uh, there are quartet testing times and I wasn't really that great <laughs> with, <laughs> when it came to doing my work during that time. So kudos to you for going through all that too and having the opportunity for studio time yeah. at, at school. Oh yeah. But all that also in te- uh, ties into you leading up to uh, contests, right? It kind of mm-hmm. gave you a great uh, way to prepare for contests. Yeah. So when it comes to winning contests, <laughs> there's, uh, there's a great deal that goes behind it. Tell me how everything went and how, like, what what's the biggest takeaway from winning the latest uh, contest that you just won for Secret Spot LA? Well, you know, I go in not really thinking I'm going to win. Okay. You know, because I've done quite a few contests to where I haven't won. Uh, okay. But, you know, I try not to let that right. deter me it's from... It's part of the game. You know? It's part of the game. It helps <laughs> Because I just don't look a certain way. That's usually what it wow. is. You know, plus Wrong. size girl. Wrong. You know? I feel like a lot of those contests I didn't win was due to image. They missed out. No, for sure. But anyways, when... Uh, I was very excited when I won that I, I to be honest I wasn't sure so when they said my name I'm just like oh what <laughs> no <laughs> me little me <laughs> but that with yeah. uh, with that entails you you're gonna be also recording with us on the Wish USA bus for a Wish Glusive correct mm-hmm. so do you have yeah. any um, do you have any music that you're about to get into uh, m- new music wise for us for the bus or you're still trying to figure out what music what songs will you be well I will be performing um, my original it's called Afar it's on all platforms okay already um, and it's a real smooth song like you can listen to when you're driving or you know like a hustle song you know what I mean okay it gets you, you know? it's, it's a really nice motivating song exactly okay it, the song is really about um distant lovers or distant people you know what I mean okay because I kind of wrote it to where people from different aspects could relate to it okay like you could either be talking about a long distance relationship or someone who's passed away oh that's kind of how I wrote it I feel like I'm going to be crying, but still doing one of these at the same time. Oh, yeah, for sure. Okay. (laughs) I'm excited for that. Do you have any future performances uh, coming up where we get to hear that? Or do you have any, because I know it's your birthday month, so are you doing any, like, karaoke style birthday celebrations where we get to hear some funny other music. The people I know here definitely want that to happen. Yeah. <laughs> it's a must. They're like, it's oh, let's do karaoke for your birthday. I was like, we'll see. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Um, we could just add that to the roster. You know? <laughs> but I do have um, a gig coming up December 7th for Q26 Showcase. Okay. Yeah, they just asked me to be a part of it, which I'm super excited about. Are there tickets to be sold? Or yes. Can, or is there a website we can go on, on go to online to buy the tickets? Um, or yes, we... it's the Q26.com, I okay. believe. Um, but they're Q26 on Instagram and everything. Okay. So you could definitely... If we wanted to be like, okay, maybe she's selling them on your website. Is there a way for us to go to your website and it goes to a link or just go to Q26? I would say just go to Q26 okay. because I will be advertising it on my Instagram okay. and such, but you would definitely probably find it faster. <laughs> you go to Q26. Q26. <laughs> 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 so with this performance coming up, it's a great way to kind of end the year. Do you see yourself doing any New Year's Eve performances? Or are you wanting that in the works? Or do that you want would to be just, great? Okay. <laughs> Put it out there. Okay, I'm manifesting yes. all type of performances. He hears it, we hear it, the universe hears it. So something's gonna Here happen. Is. Okay. <laughs> uh, I wanna ask you a little bit more about ways to find your, you and your music and your social medias, but we're gonna take a quick quick break to our sponsors real quick. Just like how guys, how you guys are passionate about music. We know how passionate our partner PSS Home Care is in care 
caring for your loved ones. So PSS Home Care makes sure that your loved ones receive every single bit of comfort they deserve right in the comfort of their own home. PSS Home Care offers a set of excellent services ranging from home health aid to physical therapy to housekeeping and many more. So if you are from the New York area and are looking for some someone to care for, for your loved ones, make sure to contact PSS Home Care by clicking on the link in our description. Don't forget PSS Home Care because caring is their culture. Now bringing it back to my Indie Tuesday Artist of the Day, Anna Maria. Caring and sharing. Yes. <laughs> I just find that hilarious because I'm actually a caregiver. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> so, you have, so you wear a lot of hats. How do you yes. find time as an artist to hone in on your craft? It is hard, but bills have to be paid. That is true. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Rent has to be paid. I feel like I just heard a word. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah that is true. Okay. As tough as it is to so, know. Yeah. So it it's easier because I'm a caregiver to where if I ever needed time off, mm. I can always be like, hey, girl, I need you to take my shift. <laughs> like, okay, yes. <laughs> you know? Sure. Which I'll I rarely do. So if I ever do, they're just like, sure. They just know. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you for caring for those who are in need of care. That goes that very that goes very unnoticed a lot, and you very know I, I feel like we need true. to give credit when credit is due, and that's a tough <laughs> job within itself. Mm -hmm. Without everything being said, that's a tough job. It is. Alongside being your your own boss and your own mm -hmm. singer songwriter, your like. You manage yourself, and that's tough enough. So, okay. but you make it look good, girl. <laughs> thank From you. From head to toe, <laughs> the lashes. Good job. Yes. <laughs> but if people want to know more about, I come to play with you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, if people want to know more about you and follow more of your musical journey and keep up to you from head to toe, what is the best social medias to follow you on? Um, well, all of my social media platforms is Anna Maria underscore Austin or just Anna Maria Austin. Okay. Uh, so, but usually Instagram is the most up to date, like okay. like that. I try to keep everything up to date, but it's hard because yes. I'm also a social media manager for somebody else. <laughs> so, I try my best. <laughs> But definitely Instagram, Anna Maria, that's A-N-N-A-M-A-R-I-A, -A okay. underscore Austin. It's just like Texas Austin. Okay. Anna yeah. Maria underscore Austin. Mm -hmm. Okay. And don't forget Q26 for tickets to her show December 7th. December 7th. Okay. <laughs> and your single is out now on all platforms? Or mm -hmm. Okay. Your single? Everywhere. Everywhere on all platforms. It's called Afar. A-F-A-R. Don't forget Anna Maria. It. Anna Maria. <laughs> Afar, out on all platforms, December 7th. And it's her birthday month, so if you want to show Woo! her some love for her birthday, December 7th exactly. is the next okay? Exactly. Thank you so much. I had so much fun with you being my Andy Tuesday Artist of the Day. Congratulations well, again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Because you sang, girl. You sang. Why, thank you. Yes. <laughs> Um, hopefully we get to see more of you yes, honey. Uh, in 2024. And until next Tuesday, wishers keep on wishing. Bye, wishers.